You have heard of Mulan, the female warrior from the Chinese Empire. Now the Hadza bears have their own. These male warriors are trying to recruit this female warrior into hunting. It's quite a tiresome activity, but she'll pull through. Seems like there's something interesting in there. Some sort of a trophy. Can she do it? They're trying to encourage her. Fingers crossed. Touche. It is right Bull's eye. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow <laughs> she's given uh, like a reward some sort of a reward like a necklace <laughs> made of skin. <laughs> they are all celebrating. <laughs> what a good debut for this female warrior. And the dog joins in. Safi, Safi. They caught a rabbit. Mission accomplished for the young lady. Not only the Hadza bears survive through hunting, but also through foraging. That's collecting. Fruits. Uh -huh. 
and uh, roots. This Hadzobe family is trying to stone a tamarind tree. I guess this wasn't successful. Recruiting a female warrior is some sort of a civilization principle, I should say. Division of labor to both men and women and to economy. But still the basic way of life to Hadzabes is hunting and gathering. As any other community, the Hadza Bears also believe in something. They believe that there are powers superior than them that control and lead them. Mm -hmm. 
This is some sort of a ritual. Thank you. To their superior powers. As it was quite a successful day in hunting. Pepper, 